Welcome to Dependable Flame, where we explore vintage petrol lighters, ashtrays, tobacchiana, and other useful mechanisms. Make yourself at home. Today we are going to reassemble the actuating mechanism on this Evans Petite Lighter with a Spitfire automatic mechanism. Go ahead and start with the plunger spring. Goes down in the hole there in the base. Nail goes down before it and then the spring. Then we want to take our file wheel, get that. Sort of pinched into place here between the ears. of this thumb lever and we we're going to hold that in place like that get our rivet So we got the rivet going through and it looks like it's lining up there. So we are going to go ahead and slip this, go ahead and pull this out real quick, screw with the nail, got ahead of myself a little bit. We're going to go ahead and put this in the vise here. You want to make sure that you got it lined up, otherwise you could do some damage. Also, it might be a good idea to put something rubber or plastic in the jaws. We're not going to be squeezing this too tight, so we will get this positioned in the vise and it looks like that popped right into place okay so now that we have that in there we go ahead and get our I hope I can find them the nail and the plunger spring. I'm going to go ahead and get those seated and down in that hole that they're made for. Get our spring in place. Now we take our snuffer with the ratchet arm, make sure that the ratchet arm goes down below the gears. And then we're going to Okay, so the ratchet arm down under the gear and then these pieces go in together here then put your other fulcrum rivet in place
And it looks like we won't even need the vise for that second one. So we got both of our rivets where they need to be. Go ahead and get our covers back in place. And sometimes I can see why people have glued or epoxy those down. That one looks like it's going to hold pretty good. This one over here doesn't look like it's holding at all. So, we get a flint in here. So now we got the flint and flint spring screw down in there, get it fueled up. So we robbed this snuffer off of the other lighter last week. It's a lighter that my mother had found in an antique store for five dollars. And I had her pick it up, but then the snuffer was broke. So we've got it replaced now. A nice faux leather. Looks like maybe ostrich or something like that. Faux leather, Evans Petite. It's a very nice looking lighter and very functional. Until next time.